Hello and welcome to the Community Spotlight interview series at studentfilmmakers.com. I'm Mora Nikolaitse, your host, and today we're excited to bring you an exclusive conversation with one of our talented community members. Hello, Vikas. How did you discover your passion for acting? I was in school when I was uh, 13. I started doing acting in uh, school plays and that fascinated me towards this art form when I first did it. And yes, after that, I just kept doing it and kept learning. After that, I think uh, for my education, I took a two or three year uh, break from acting when I was 15. And after that, when I was 18, I started it again when I was doing engineering. That's when I uh, really started enjoying it like more and more. Because when I did it first in school, it was more of a childish act. But uh, when I did it later, I was more fascinated toward the art. So yeah, I was really happy and I, I, I discovered a lot and I'm learning a lot through this art form. So yeah, it, it's a joyful process and I'm enjoying it. How did you end up working at the short film Body Stories Together? There's a platform, there's an application, a phone application in India, India Film Project. And that is uh, specially made for artists, all kind of artists. They can create their profile and they can connect with each other and make short films, make any kind of art together. So I saw a post on that application, uh, posted by Maridu's director of our short film. And I contacted her. And I just asked if there is any opportunity for me. Uh, she sent all the details about the project and I was interested. I, I talked to her and we just started working together. The filmmaking process is interesting for me. Uh, starting from script reading, learning about the story and the character and, you know, uh, shooting part, post-production, everything fascinates me a lot. I just like to tell stories and acting is just a medium which fascinates more and more. So I'm just, uh, you know, learning filmmaking and acting and everything. Yeah, I enjoyed shooting a lot because that's the, I think for actor, the fun is shooting part fascinates me a lot and I enjoy it a lot. What future plans do you have? I'm working on short films and uh, I, I also try to create reels and short videos sometimes. Um, yeah, I just I just like to do everything and I'm doing it in any way possible in multiple platforms, Instagram. Um, before this, I used to do it on TikTok, but unfortunately, it, uh, it, it, was, it is now banned in India. So we don't do TikTok and we are working on Instagram, YouTube and uh, many other platforms. I also sometimes uh, perform on stage because I also do anchoring, uh, hosting events. So, yeah, I'm also doing it parallel. If you could give an advice to somebody who is just starting and who wants to be an actor, based on your experience, what would that advice be? Just start doing it. Just start doing it. Don't hesitate. You will make mistakes, but you will learn through the process and you will learn on the way. So just start doing it in any way possible. Uh, theater acting, stage acting, camera acting. Um, just Keep your phone on tripod and start shooting yourself. Start recording yourself. That's the way you learn. If you don't get a chance to go to film school or acting school, you just uh, start recording yourself. Go to YouTube, go to internet and you can learn a lot. So yeah, that's the way. And that concludes our Community Spotlight interview. To our viewers and listeners, thank you for tuning in to this exclusive interview at studentfilmmakers.com. We hope you've enjoyed it and found it helpful for your creative journey. Remember to visit our website for more insightful interview resources and networking opportunities with fellow filmmakers and storytellers. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel, youtube.com forward slash studentfilmmakers to stay updated on upcoming Community Spotlight interviews and other excited content. We also invite the new filmmakers and listeners to join our online community at www.studentfilmmakers.com. Until our next interview, stay creative and happy filmmaking.